Hi, um, I'm John Cox. My character is George Sikowski. I am the mayor and a uh, one-time fabulous point guard for uh, the uh, Fillmore. What are we? The Fillmore what? I don't know. We never picked that, did we? Interesting. No. We should no, have a we name. We for don't ourselves. know our. Uh, yes, we have an alma mater that we know, but we don't have a. We're just Fillmore. Yeah. The Rebels, maybe. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> um, so that's my character. I'm Chris Forensic. I'm playing uh, James Daly. I was also a, uh, a, a senior member of their championship season. Um, my character is a junior high school principal. And he's also uh, my campaign manager. Uh, my, I'm, my character is running for re-election and uh, is being challenged by um, somebody in the town, a newer person, newer progressive ideas. And he's kind of going against everything that our, uh, our teammates and our coach, who is kind of our leader, has instilled in us. And it's just a change of pace, and they're not really willing to change very much. No. No. Some of the aspects of my character represent some of the it? worst aspects of myself. You get drunk. Um, and, and, and this is an uncomfortable thing, kind of. Mm. You know, sometimes when you play a character that you don't quite like. Yeah. Um, sometimes that's fun, though. It is. It is. It's definitely fun. Yeah. Um, sometimes you see in that character little bits of yourself, and to make the portrayal a little more truthful, you dig that out of yourself. Yeah. And that's the discomfort then usually plays pretty well though for, I mean for the audience if you can get to that place oh yeah it's, it's very it plays it's it very plays a whole heck of a lot better uh, yeah. yeah for my character um, I don't know my family was in politics so I mean I've grown up around politicians and seen good and bad ones and uh, so I think I can pull a little bit from that um, you know uh, other than being on multiple sports teams also the idea of camaraderie and working as a team I think that I kind of can identify with greatly because my character is pretty much the everybody's dads are talked about in the show except for my dad mm -hmm. they never speak of my dad but sort of the coach becomes sort of your father kind of, yeah, yeah the father figure so i am hook line and sinker 1-800 coach so i'm still very tied into the old school ways i think and i'm more of the raw raw guy and so i think being on teams in the past and things like that i can i can identify with that my character is very bitter. Um, he's sarcastic and he's a, a, a very big whiner. Mm. Um, and those are things I try to avoid. This is the best cast, the strongest uh, group of men I've ever worked with. Sometimes in community theater, you get people who like to be on stage or like to be seen. And then there's another group of actors who like to act for the the acting and for where, where you can go as a character and that's what I find with this cast which I think really really blends well and helps us get into character more. I want him to respect me. I like the idea too of how progressive the playhouse has become. This is a grittier show than I think you would usually see on this main stage here and this is part of the Griffith Adler series and we're doing it on the main stage. I think it's a good way too to blend in to the mainstream audiences because I think that the, the mindset here is to try to keep up with what is going on elsewhere and trying to keep the theater in Youngstown relevant, which I think the playoffs is doing right now. Uh, the championship season. You got to come see the championship season.